What's the most preferred insurance brand in Seattle? No? Uh-uh. Wrong again. There you go. This is how a conservative, regional insurance company is beating some of the world's most powerful brands at their own game. It's a story about finding love, even in the unlikeliest, most unlovable industry of all, and turning people not just into customers, but into loyal, love-spreading fans of Pemco's brand. As it always does, our story starts with consumers. We talked to hundreds of them. And to no one's surprise, we found that one, people don't like insurance. So we decided not to talk about it. And they really don't want to hear more about it, at least until they need it. We also found that people in the Northwest like to feel special. We're a land of individuals, and we have a soft spot for the people and companies that make this place what it is. We knew if we positioned Pemco as a great local company with deep roots in the Northwest, we'd have something totally unique, an insurance company people would feel good about. So we developed a campaign that didn't bore people with insurance. Instead, we focused on something everyone wants to talk about. We'd talk about the neighbors. Relentless recycler, you're one of us. Pemco's Northwest Profiles campaign included broadcast, out of home, and online advertising. We negotiated partnerships with other local brands and professional sports teams. We created Northwest Profiles trading cards to be used in guerrilla marketing efforts and local events. And we designed a special microsite that now features more than 70 different profiles. And that encourages friends and neighbors to upload photos of, well, their friends and neighbors. People in the Northwest didn't just buy it, they loved it. And this small, conservative company was making news. Oh, a new ad campaign, challenging Seattleites to see themselves as others see them. Indigenous Seattleite is easily identifiable in its many forms. The male action figure, that's every single one of my friends. We knew we were on to something when we ended up not just around the water cooler, but in obituaries. Pemco's campaign continues to generate hundreds of tweets, blog entries, news stories, etc. It's a brand that continues to benefit from the participation of our audience. A brand being built from the bottom up, not just from the top down. A brand that continues to win fans more than just transactions. Within six months, Pemco had reversed declining trends in sales and market share and began experiencing double-digit growth. And in terms of brands most likely to be shopped, Pemco has moved from sixth place into first, making Pemco the most preferred insurance brand in its market area. All because we did what every challenger brand has got to find a way to do. We were willing to be a little different. 